All this started in November of 2021. He told us he, he didn't feel good. We all had COVID. We we're all in our own houses. Um, we called the ER. They took him to Southwest Medical Center in Liberal. So that next morning, they flew him to Topeka. Um, once he got to Topeka, like two hours later, he got intubated right away. From there, we went to um, Kansas City, and he was there for up until April. So he was there for quite a few months. Um, they had originally told us there that there was nothing to do for him anymore, and we had to make the decision of him um, pulling or well, pulling the plug um, whenever we wanted to. We decided not to do that because we didn't think we could let go of him because he was still awake and alert. After that, he came here to Hutch, um, and it was just like a miracle. Like, once he got here, we saw improvement like within that week. Like, we had never seen him walk. We had never seen him talk like he talks now, eating. We thought he was never gonna be able to eat. It's just a miracle what one month of good employees did here. So when Juan first came in, it was July, and at that point he had been in the month, for, in, been in the hospital for about eight months. Um, and when he first got in, he was basically bed level. So a lot of therapy at the beginning, we were just trying to get him to sit edge of bed, and we had to try to hold that position, work on core strength, and just get his tolerance up, because that's all he could do. That would wipe him out for the rest of the day. Um, he wasn't able to tolerate normal food. He had to go down to softer foods so that he could actually eat regular food. He had tube feedings. He had a lot going on. He's come a long way. His last day of therapy he actually walked 129 feet, which is huge progress. He definitely beat the odds. With occupational therapy, he was able to go back to riding. He couldn't do that before. And with speech therapy, he got to eat totally normal diet, doesn't have to use the tube feeding anymore. It's amazing progress that he's made just in six weeks go from literally sitting edge of bed and that exhausting him to walking around the whole unit. He's very happy with everybody here in this facility. Ever since he got here they've treated him very good. Um, he, he was able to walk for the first time again, eat, talk, he, 10 months without seeing his grandkids and he He's ready to see them. So we, we would like to thank on behalf of our, all our family, everything you guys did for us. Because it's, he beat all the odds and knowing that we would lose him at one point and seeing all the improvement he did here, it's just breathtaking. Like it's a miracle for us that he's here and we're just so thankful everything you guys did because we went through a mil like a lot of facilities and nobody did the work you guys did it's been one crazy 10 months